What an incredible Tuesday morning it has been, everybody. So you wake up, and the first thing I see specifically is Scream, okay? Then the second thing I see is that Sora is the new character, the final character in Smash Bros. Ultimate. I could not be having, and maybe this is jinxing me, I could not be having a better Tuesday morning. So hopefully it won't get ruined within the next five minutes. I'm sure it will, but welcome in. This is exciting. This is very, very exciting. So what am I talking about? Well, if you didn't see it, if, you don't, if you're not on Twitter, which I do not blame you because it's hell on earth, what, to, what this is is Scream's official Twitter handle posted, okay, seven blood drops, okay, a little blood, a little, little blood rainy, you know, whatever you want to call it, but that's what they did, and then they they have a, an emoji, so really I would say this uh, this announcement, quote unquote, right, is really two, two in one, now the emoji thing isn't the biggest deal in the world, however, it does, I think, signal a couple things, whenever anything, movies, games, properties, you know, anything like that, whenever they get an emoji, it is normally to signal like we're close to something. Sometimes they do it before trailers. Sometimes they do it before release. It depends on, you know what I mean? It depends on what it's like. Some games will specifically get it uh, right before they come out. Or like uh, for me, like I look at like game shows. So like they'll do that for them. Like as we get a, a couple months away from like game awards or something, they'll give them an emoji. So it basically signals like something's coming very soon. Cool. You know what I mean? That's that's something we we hoped to see. That's not nothing really all that surprising. It looks really cool. You know, it's Ghostface. He looks pretty cute. You know, you got all that. I'm waiting, by the way, for the Funko Pops to come out because I'm I really love Funko Pops and I'd love to have all of them for this new Scream movie. But we also again had basically the seven the blood drops. Which what could that mean? Well, there's really only one thing it means. It's seven days. Okay, so. And that, I guess it doesn't have to mean that, but I just think the general consensus online is that it does mean that. I mean, look, look where we are, right? Seven days today is October 12th. And, and, and you know, I'm not the only one saying it, but just going back to what I've said in past videos, that, that Airbnb. Now, remember, it, it, the, the rumor that the trailer drops worldwide online on October 12th. It's been going around for a while. I just think the Airbnb thing really solidified it in my mind, and I've been running, uh, you know, running with it ever since that happened. And again, if you don't know what I'm talking about, remember the how they did the whole thing with David Arquette where you could book Stu's house, you know, officially, and that opens. You can't book it right now. The first day to book it is October 12th, and I said back then, I was like, well, that's a weird, you know, not actually, but, you know, that's a weird date for them to do it, and, you know, obviously, because I think that lines up with the trailer, and then we also heard, you know, even before then, that the trailer would be shown for this, you know, Fandango event, this 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 scream, uh, you know, going back in theaters, and then you would see it online. It would drop online on the twelfth, and that was an early rumor that it, I think is now going to be, you know, completely confirmed because see, again, seven days from today is October twelfth and is next Tuesday. So I would say everything's locked in at this point. You know, what I mean, I think. No, I tweeted them. I don't think they're going to tweet back. But, the I, well, they are tweeting back to some people. They're saying, like, is the anticipation killing you and, and kind of making funny jokes, kind of like, you know, I, I guess related, scream-related, right? Uh, you know, I would like them to respond because, you know, here we are seven days away. Now, actually, funny enough, didn't I predict this? I did predict a few days ago that on Tuesday they would confirm the trailer's going to be in theaters. Now, they didn't confirm the trailer's going to be in theaters, but I would argue today is Tuesday, and they just confirmed what date everybody's going to be seeing the trailer. So if you stretch out my prediction, I actually was right, and I predicted that last week. I don't think anybody else uh, maybe said that. So just want to give myself a pat on the back because I'm never right with anything, so I want to just, uh, you know, credit myself w when it happens. But, you know, I would like to know, you know, if it's going to happen because at this point, you know, you have the UK thing that Charles, Prince Charles Theater or whatever, like, you know, that's going to happen on the 11th. Like, they don't make a mistake like that just on accident. In fact, and, and you, let me even add this, somebody responded, a, a person who claims to work in a theater chain, to a Scream Obsessed, I believe, and they said, like, the, tra the trailer is coming. Like, they're waiting for it to process in their systems. So, like, you know, you could believe that or not believe that, but that is right there pretty much confirmation that, like, theaters are getting the trailer so you know would it be the end of the world if they didn't confirm it and we all whoever's going you know sunday monday i know some people are going maybe even on like friday or saturday you know people that are allowed to go whenever would, would, would it kill us if we didn't know the trailer was going to happen and we just kind of went and it was like oh my dear jesus christ like no that would be that would be pretty cool in its own way it's just i don't know for people that are skeptical or people that are a little bit worried 
well, you know, I, I'd like to know. And honestly, I guess there's still, well, no, you know, I was going to say, like, maybe they could still only show us a teaser in theaters and then show the full trailer online uh, on Tuesday. But I mean, the trailer has been rated. I don't know why you would give like a condensed version at this anniversary thing. So I, I'm, I'm still going to stick with we're going to see it again. So I'm going to go on Sunday. So I will see it. I will, um, you know, I'm not going to say what I'm going to do with the trailer. And it's not necessarily what you guys think it is. But I'm going to, you know, I'll be watching it. And, and hopefully we can throw some videos together. And then Tuesday, you know, the entire world gets to see it. So I, I'm absolutely pumped. I cannot wait for this. Um, again, like this is an amazing way to wake up on a Tuesday, see Sora for Smash, the dream literally coming to life, which I would argue is actually a little bit bigger of a deal than this Scream thing. But then also Scream, you know, again, I, I guess c confirming, inadvertently confirming, you know, seven days away. No matter what, you know, whether you're going, I don't even know. I mean, you guys can let me know actually in the comments. Like, are you going to see the movies on uh, on Sunday or Monday? You know, let me know. I am, like I've said before, I'm going to see it on Sunday. But I don't even know, you know, how many people are going to do it. And, and let's be real, in the grand scheme of things, in the world, there's not, it, you know, how we always talk about, right? Like, we're this hardcore, this dedicated fan base, but we do have to think sometimes that, you know, Scream plays to many, many people, m way more than us, right? So that also, I think, does apply here, where it's like, yeah, sure, some of us, you know, and again, very small percentage if you look at the whole thing, some of us are going to see the movie and see the trailer for, for Scream 5 early, basically, right? If we go see it in theaters, but the, 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 the world, you know, a much bigger percentage of the overall audience, they're not going to go, you know, see it. When I booked, I don't know about you guys, I don't know how filled my theater is going to be. When I booked it, it was not very packed. So we'll see what it's like now, you know, when, when I actually go see it. But, you know, even then, you know, we're talking about maybe a couple tens of thousands of people, right? Tens of thousands that are going to see it. But we're talking about millions that are going to see the trailer when it drops online. So this is, the, I would say, a much bigger deal. So let me know what you guys think in the comments. Like I said, let me know, are you seeing the movie, you know, Sunday, Monday? I know some people told me they're seeing it like on the 8th. I don't even know how that's possible, but you know what? I'm not going to doubt that. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Make sure, as always, you guys are subscribed, bell icon turned on. If you guys want to follow me over on Twitter or subscribe to my second channel or support us on Patreon or YouTube memberships, links for all of them are in the description below. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you all on the next video.